Hello everyone, Leon here, back to the channel. First video of 2024, coming at you from cold, misty Madrid here in Spain. Today is a short video, but I think it's a very important one because we're going to be discussing why winning is a habit. Because if you study the most elite performers, doesn't matter if you do it on business, you do it on sports, the arts, the best of the best, those that play competitive games, those that had a competition going on against others or against themselves, they always end up saying a variation of winning is a habit, learn how to win and then never stop winning. But then the question then becomes, and this is a question that one of our clients asked me the other day, how can winning be a habit? Because you can be very good at one specific domain, how can you win at everything? And in my view, it all boils down to what I call the system's mindset. Most people go through life seeing the world as a random collection of events things that just happen, things that just exist. And they never really ponder about how all of these things relate to each other. If you start looking at how things relate to each other, you realize that everything in the universe is a systematic entity. Everything is a system. Everything is related to everything else. And a system is nothing else than a very simple relationship between cause and effect that you can affect, that you can actually manipulate to get the results. In your body, you have the respiratory system, you have the cardiac system, you have the nervous system, you have tons of systems, right? Also, the reality you have habit, the business you're building, the relationship you had with your friends or your significant other. And why is this relevant, you may ask? Because when you see everything as a system, you realize that systems follow a series of rules, right? There's cause and effect relationships that can be audited for improvement, to see everything as a system in order to replicate the outcome that, that system can give you. That is how you turn a wish into a very predictable outcome. So instead of wondering whether you will get your goals, you just expect them to happen. Everything you want in life is just one system and one transformation away. The system is yours to design and the transformation is yours to experience. If you were to double your business, let's just send twice as many cold emails, right? If you want to absolutely guarantee the outcome, you would send five times more emails. And that is the system you create. So what about the transformation? You must be able to send five times more emails to get twice as many clients without doubting yourself, without burning out for overwork, without, you know, getting progressively stressed out. And this is the magic of system, because if you know your personal capacity for sending as many emails, you probably cannot work five times harder to send as many. So you've got to design a different system in order to be able to send them. But that is a different conversation. But the point is, if you become able to send five times more emails and also transform yourself into a system operator without getting distracted, without getting doubtful, without burning out, you will achieve that goal. And that is the magic of pairing personal transformation with systems design, because it gives you the ability to achieve anything you want, provided that you design the right system and become the right person. That's it. So when people say winning is a habit, it's not because they're special or they, yeah, or you could say they're special because they become special, but it's because they have learned to look at reality from this systematic perspective and they ask themselves, let's say Federer, if I want to win over, let's say, if you want to win in the US Open, what should I do? Should I wish for it? Or should I study every single one of the potential competitors to find their weaknesses so that I know how to play against them? Nail my diet so I have full energy? Nail my sleep so I have full energy when the time comes? And that demystifies the whole process of winning. Winning is not something that just a few are able to achieve. Winning is something that is available to every single person that decides to master the system of the game that you are playing. That's it. There's no magic in it. If you want to lose 20 pounds, understand what is the caloric deficit that you need to have every single day and just, just go as many days as you need in order to get those 20 pounds less of fat in your body. That's it. Winning is a habit 
extracts valuable data from those systems. Anders Ericsson said that any skill in order to be master required between you know, 10 hours and 10,000 hours, even 20,000 hours in some cases. What he said affected the most to this ratio was a concept called deliberate practice. Deliberate practice is nothing else that learning from your daily practice. When you say practice makes perfect, that is not exact. Practice makes permanent. What makes perfect is deliberate practice, which is data in form or feedback in form practice, right? So if you want to be absolute elite at everything, design the systems that will give you the outcomes you want. Start looking at the data those systems are giving you in order to make them more efficient. In back to the cold email example, if you want to double your clients, you probably don't need to five times the number of emails you send out. You probably should become better at script writing, our targeting, our every single subcomponent of the system so that the efficiency of the whole machine improves. If you want you yourself to perform at elite performance, you need to understand what systems are affecting your poor performance. What is it? Find it and then solve it. And over time, system by system, solution by solution, you get the results you want. So this is a very important video because it really gives you the perspective you need to achieve anything you want. If I hope this video is useful. I train and coach entrepreneurs into peak performance. If you are into this content and you want to win, click the subscribe button. But above all, have an absolute, resounding, fantastic 2024.